Christmas.
It's a happy napper. It's a unicorn. It got. It's basically a a, a sleeping bag. It's with a pillow. Just so, it's just so. I like it, Jimmy. What are you got, Now I got all my uh, 
Okay. So I'm looking here. Yeah, that's okay. 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 Yeah, that's Y'all have not seen us in forever. We haven't been vlogging, y'all. <laughs> y'all know how we roll with vlogging. Um, but Merry Christmas. I figure we'll pop in and say, hey, y'all, hey. Merry Christmas. See how y'all Christmas is going. Ours, oh, it's going well. It's still early. Um, what time is it? It is 10 minutes to two. <laughs> We've been up since seven. Do you get up at seven? Yeah. Yeah, we've been up since about 7 o'clock. We didn't start opening up gifts and stuff until like 8.30, but Journey, of course, the first one to walk. She was the first one to get up, per usual. That's what she do every day, except for when she's going to school. <laughs> Ain't that weird? So annoying. We gotta drag her out of the bed during the week. On the weekend and on breaks, she gets up just fine. But we are chilling. The hub sits right there, he's eating. Yo. <laughs> he eating, what you eating, pork pot? Pork tamales. And chicken. Oh, he eating pork and chicken tamales, rice. And um, I am sitting me, my old fashioned. And he was drinking Long Island. <laughs> we had just had like, some drinks. Journey is actually laying down because she's been up since five. Um, Aiden told me that Don't she jump. got up at five o'clock and um, turned on his light, looking for remote control, trying to turn TV on. So it was time for her to take a nap. She be needing five minutes. Cause if she be up forever, she'll just go, go, go. But then she gets delirious and then everything annoys her. And then she starts whining about everything. So she's taking a nap. <laughs> so I'm like, we gonna chill. Um, I'm actually edit this vlog and it'll go up the day after Christmas. So as you guys can see it. <laughs> um, but we had a good Christmas. The kids had a good Christmas. Um, I had a good Christmas. I got some earrings y'all. They cute or whatever. Um, I have not worn earrings like on a daily basis unless I put my earrings in that I made. Um, if it goes with what I'm wearing, it, I haven't I haven't worn earrings in forever, and I'm like I need some because I'd be wanting to put some on if I do have my hair like up. You can see my ears, so how's it dig it? I just have to get used to actually wearing them. <laughs> um, but they are cute. I like them, and I got my uh, perfume. Uh, very good girl and good girl. Those heels, it's I can't think of her name. Herrera. Christina Herrera. Is that is that it? Oh, look at him, Christina Herrera. But I had got that in the sample pack. I went to Ulta and we each got um, the sample packs that they have, and that was one of my favorites. I was like, oh, this smells good, good. Perfume is expensive, y'all. <laughs> I'm like, people just be coming in and getting several bottles of these at one time. Like, who does that? But yeah, kids had good Christmas. We had a good Christmas. Listen, our Christmas was our house, okay? I told everybody, I'm like, listen, Christmas is the crib. It's what it is. Um, but yeah, we just chilling. Hopefully, the NBA commentator is not taking over my video. Hold on a second, y'all. It's the one. Where's the outside? Oh, we watching football. Packers and the Dolphins. And the Dolphins is not doing what they were supposed to do at all. We broke them. <laughs> Literally, because they've been trash ever since they played us. 
Like, they've been struggling. <laughs> we did good, y'all. We doing good this season. Uh, seeing as all of our uh, issues that we've been having. <laughs> we're on our third string quarterback, but we're still doing good. So, that's actually a good thing. Um, but, yeah, we kind of just been chilling. We got the kids a trampoline, y'all. Listen, let me tell you. We surprised them with that. Hubby put it together while they was at camp because they on break. And he put it together while they, was on, um, while they were in camp. And we surprised them with that yesterday um, because they would have seen it because he barbecued. So, we was like, we are just surprised them first thing in the morning. And then that way, once he started barbecuing, she came out here. She jumped literally all day, y'all. And when I tell you she jumped all day and still was not tired, I'm like, what's, what's happening? <laughs> we was just... Me and Hubster were playing. He kicked my ass, y'all. Okay? So, <laughs> I beat Aiden, and then he came back and, like, literally took all of my pieces. So, we are... He wanted to eat first, and we're going to come out here and play another game. Because I'm like, hold on. What, it, what What's happening? Um, But, I want to show y'all the trampoline. Then I'm going to tell y'all how much we got this trampoline for, surprisingly. We still haven't finished the backyard yet, so don't judge us. So... This is the trampoline. That's the 14 foot one. So the kids, of course, when we move, have been asking us, can we have a trampoline? Journey is in gymnastics. Um, I'll try to get some clips and put it in so y'all can see her. Um, but she's in gymnastics and she's doing really well. They want to move her up to the level right below the competing level. Um, so she's doing good. And uh, so they both was like, I want a trampoline. And when Aiden goes with us, when she goes to um, gymnastics, he be like, he be like, I want to jump. <laughs> so they I kept asking for him. We was like, okay, we'll see, y'all. Me and hubby just by chance walked into Walmart um, for for something other than a trampoline, and everybody is walking out with these trampolines. Like they got several boxes of trampolines in their carts. So hubby was like, are they giving away those for free? Like what's happening? And <laughs> I was like, I don't know. So as we was going in, we was asking people, y'all, that trampoline was fifty bucks. They had clearance it down to 50 bucks. That's a $300 trampoline. They clearance it down to $50. So, of course, we was in there close to the time the kids needed to be um, in, close to the time we needed to pick them up from school. But I told y'all, after they opened up those extra lanes, we haven't, like, we can get there last minute and still be in a good position. And so, <laughs> um, so we went. And literally picked it up right before we picked them up from school. We got that, picked it up. We had to, of course, we had to put it in the car so we couldn't get them in the trampoline. We was able to make it back home, drop it off. We've had that trampoline since August. And um, so they were super surprised. And she's been mousing ever since. So I'm like, gives her something else to do outside of when they go to the park and she plays at the park and stuff. But they were super excited to see that. Um, but um another interception came over what I don't oh know who two of us throwing to. he broke broke he broke broke sorry y'all <laughs> but yeah so 50 because y'all believe that i said nobody would believe about this 50 dollars <laughs> i said ain't no way because we told him he was like okay we gonna see but i'm like i wasn't getting 300 dollar trampoline right now I said it was me. I made, um, y'all know, typically for Christmas Eve, when we used to do our Christmas Eve parties, we did um, Mexican night. Um, we did Mexican food. So we still kind of kept that tradition. It was just us here yesterday. Um, I made chicken and steak, chicken, steak, and cheese enchiladas. And we had rice and beans, chips, and then hubby, when he put the carne asada on the grill, uh, he made some hamburgers. For germ, because Aiden he eats Angelala. She hasn't stepped into that world yet. Hopefully she'll do it soon. But until then, <laughs> he made burgers for her. And we haven't left us today. <laughs> I'm like, that's the only thing I love. That's one thing I love about Christmas because whatever we cook on Christmas Eve, we're eating it for Christmas too. <laughs> it is what it is. And then our plan is to make gumbo for New Year's Day. So yeah, that's about it, y'all. We ain't been putting up no fuss. Hubby is still at home. He goes in like once a week for work. Um, the kids are enjoying school. They're both doing good. Um, like, we're really proud of them. Like, under the circumstances with us moving. 
both made friends and everything. Journey got invited to a birthday party. Um, Ada hasn't gotten invited to any birthday parties yet, but she got invited to her first um, birthday party. And I think hers came because when, when we moved, they went to camp and the little girl that's in her class was at camp with her as well. So she knew who she was and they ended up in the same class when they started school. So I was like, that was super dope. Y'all, that, that was my goal. I was like, cool, if they go to camp, They'll be able to meet some kids, hopefully, that's going to be at the school with them. And it just so happened that they did. So, I'm like, that worked out very, very well. But, yeah, they doing it. We know that. I'm still working at home, of course. Yeah, I know. Nothing has changed there. <laughs> um, but, uh, that's about it. I just wanted to pop in and say, hey, y'all, hey. Kind of catch y'all up. And this guy. You want to talk to the people? <laughs> He broke his stuff, y'all. That's why I got to tell y'all. I bet she was sitting over there hoping she better not say nothing. Mm-hmm. He decided to get in the trampoline and start flipping. Like he be flipping every day. And then pulled the damn muscle. I said, bro, when he was jumping, you need to get down. You need you need to chill. Because you don't do that every day. And he don't listen. So now he broke halfway anyway. Girl. Pulled the oblique muscle. I'm like, for real? Like... I was worried about the kids. Here you are. How might I help you, Mr. Burrow? How might I help you? I'm still going back. <laughs> How might I help I'm you? <laughs> going back. As soon as I'm clear. I can't. I told him, like, can you be careful? <clears throat> you don't flip every day. He be swearing. Between that, he played football. He ain't hurt himself doing football. They, him and Aiden did the, what is it called? Turkey bowl? Him and Aiden did the, their first turkey boat, y'all. Okay, so, I right, Miss Thanksgiving. So Thanksgiving, we cook what we normally do. It was just us, you know, uh, and they, our neighbors, um, his church, they do a turkey boat every year. So hubby has been talking about this turkey boat situation, y'all, for years, but he, we've never been around where people actually do it. So um, our neighbor just so does it. And he invited them to the turkey bowl. And him and Aiden went, because Aiden, you know, he's into football too. So he was like, this would be a good, you know, practice for him. And they went, y'all. They played. He didn't break himself, so I was happy about that. But he was able to play in his first turkey bowl. Him and Aiden, they had so much fun. I'm like, that's going to be a tradition from there. for them. I'm sure they're going to do it. Because it's like, shit, they left. Aiden left at 730. He left with the neighbor at 730. And then Hubby met them there right after he got done with the turkey because that's tip typically um that's typically what he cooks is the turkey so he wanted to make sure that was almost done before he left so yeah they were able to do their first turkey bowl me and um jern stayed at the house she helped me grate the cheese and make the macaroni i was like this is so cool this is such good memories um to make because it reminded me of grating cheese when i was making uh macaroni and cheese with my auntie when she used to cook for thanksgiving so i was like that was super cool um but they were able to do that and halloween we actually went with the same neighbors their church had the um the trunk or treat set up so we went y'all why so <laughs> we love our husbands right so the husband sent <laughs> hubby the flyer the address wasn't on the the flyer so hubby just googled it so when he googled it it's a church but it has it has different locations why we end up at the wrong location the kids in there, they didn't have hot dogs and <laughs> they had hot dogs and juice. They sitting down eating and they like, I don't see y'all. He's like, I don't see y'all neither. I'm outside. Why we was at the wrong place? I said, really? Really? Like it was, it was the funniest thing. So finally, when we got to the right church, he was like, I am so sorry. <laughs> like I didn't realize that the address was not on there. So yeah, we ended up at the wrong place church for the trunk or treat but when we got there we saw everything that you know it but the we should have realized when it wasn't nobody in the cars everything they had the stuff set up on the inside because they do like the chili cook off and all of that stuff it was cars outside decorated but they weren't at the car so i was like that probably should have been our first clue that this wasn't the church however we made it to the right church um but they have uh kids that's more journey's age so she gets to go and you know play with them but we know the whole block y'all we don't got with the whole block we had one of the um neighbors had a um get together for her birthday 
uh, right before hubby's birthday, the weekend before hubby's birthday. Um, so we all got together with the neighbors and we all chilled and ate. Everybody brought food. We ate, drank, you know. So that's one good thing. I'm so like, this was just like moving into an area and then it being an area where everybody on the block is brand new, like is like, it's, it's the life right now because we literally know everybody that's on the block. Um, and that's just a good thing. Like nobody, you know how you move on them blocks and it'd be people that have been there for years and they feel like they own the block. Like with our block, it's not like that because everybody is like fresh. So, um, and then we still have, it's like three more houses where um, people haven't moved in yet. So, but we'll be able to, you know, everybody pretty much that moved in, like after us, everybody that came over and introduced themselves and, you know, um, just like, it, it's super cool to know the whole block. <laughs> and especially having the kids when they outside playing, you know, got extra eyes. But, um, yeah, so that's about it. I think that's that's it. Now that I'm thinking about it, I'm like, I ain't, we ain't talked to y'all forever, so... Is, is it a lot to catch up on? Like, it's small things, but it, it's nothing really big that we've done. Um, yeah, I think that's about it. We had a party. Uh, we had a get together for Hubby and Jern for their birthdays. Um, yeah, we had a get together for um, Hubby and Journey's birthday. And then um, Thanksgiving, Halloween, Aiden's birthday. Yeah, Aiden had his cousins over. They spent the weekend with him. It was a surprise he didn't know. Um, Hubby and Journey, we had to get together. Um, it was a surprise for Journey. Uh, her cousins came over, so she got to hang with them. And then, yeah, Thanksgiving and Christmas. And then it'll be New Year's. So, yeah, we've had a good last six months. Are we six, seven months, give or take? Um, but, yeah, things been going good, y'all. Yeah couldn't be more of a blessing like I'm still just so it's still kind of surreal like we, we really in the crib like we, we in the crib crib so I'm still just thankful like I still get up every day like wow like when you set a goal and you and you reach that goal like it's crazy it, it, it's definitely a uh, uh, a joyous moment so and I, I'm so happy we moved when we did because we were able to literally celebrate all of the holidays outside of Easter and um, Valentine's Day, all of the holidays in the new home. So like that really was good. And I was able to spend my birthday um, with my mom and them when they were here, the kids graduation. So like that all worked out, like it worked out so good. <laughs> I'm like, we're able to have all the holidays in the new home. Like what's, what's the odds of that? <laughs> so, but yeah, I'm 23. Get here. I'm going to try to vlog a little bit more. Maybe get a vlog out a week. But y'all know if we don't be doing nothing. Like we still learning the area. Um, and we try to go like to the different things we did. Oh, we went to the Nutcracker. <laughs> we actually, the local studio, they the local dance studio, they put on the Nutcracker every year. So we actually went to the Nutcracker uh, on the 16th of December. And it was at the uh, local college. And it was actually nice. We had a good time. I'll put in a picture here. <laughs> We all got dressed up, not dressed up, but Journey was the dressiest, y'all know. Listen, what she gonna do is get dressed, okay? Um, but we went to go and see that. Then um, the rec center had a family tea party with cast from the Nutcracker. So like, it was like a smaller, they kind of did like a preview of what the show is going to be. And so we went to that, so that was really good. <laughs> about it so yeah we try to do like a lot of the local things because like i said we in a smaller town compared to where we were um so just doing like small town things so just getting to know the area still um but yeah other than that y'all i don't think nothing else is up when you, i think i caught y'all up on everything <laughs> like i'm like i caught y'all up on everything um i've had family they they've come uh, my sister came. I didn't vlog when they was here. I told y'all that. Um, and then my cousin and her husband and kids came. They came come twice because um, her husband's mom stays out here. So she came to visit. Um, but yeah. That's about it, y'all. 
we just chilling, chilling. Me and hubby actually did a weight loss challenge. So that was good. We did a 45 day weight loss challenge. Um, and we did good, y'all. I'll show a picture of that. <laughs> We're kind of like we're not still doing the challenge but we kind of stand on we're staying within what we were doing with the sugars and stuff because it was like a no carbs it was no carbs no sugar um no car no no yeah no bread like potatoes carbs basically no carbs no sugars like it was y'all the first week was rough when i tell y'all i was like i'm not gonna make it <laughs> but yeah no carbs no sugar no alcohol um so basically we were eat, we were eating protein vegetables and um a starch but the starch was like brown rice or quinoa uh sweet potatoes so that is yeah <sighs> y'all oh that first week but then after the first week i was able to do it i lost 20 pounds so i was like oh my god it's so crazy because i was so complacent um in my size because the scale really wasn't reflecting um how how i look per se but after losing the weight and then going back and looking at pictures i was like bro why y'all ain't telling me why y'all ain't telling me that i was like a little, little heavy okay so once i lost the weight it was like girl okay like, bringing sexy back is is how i felt literally and i still feel really good um and i'm happy that i did it because my knee was starting to bother me. And I'm like, my little ankles is not holding up my body, for real. So, proud of that. So, we just keeping it up. Maintaining it. You know, drinking moderations. During holidays, typically. Um, but, yeah. So, we're doing good. And I'm proud of that. And then, I will show, like I said, I'll show y'all the pictures. But, I'm going to quit talking, y'all. Because, of course, I come back to vlog and this is what happened. Then, y'all get a 30-minute vlog. Because I'm sitting up here rambling and running my mouth, you know. Um, but... Hope you guys are having a good one, and we will talk back to y'all later. I'm back. I bet y'all didn't think I was coming back, did y'all? See, I be trying. Oops, hold on. I be trying. So, the kids are woke. Oops, sorry. Hold on, y'all. Because that's a no. Give y'all a little bit of, um. Uh, so, kids are up, of course. Journey's up from her nap. It's dark outside at this point. Because when she got up, she played and then she wanted to go to the park. So her brother took her to the park. Um, we are about to sit outside. It's cold. So we're about to sit outside. So we just started the fire. So I'm going to sit outside and finish editing the vlog. So y'all can have this vlog today as y'all watching it. Today. I'm going to do better. That's my plan is to do better. So I'm gonna go back out in the living room. Journey is listening to Christmas music, so it's gonna get loud. So let me pause for a second. What's up, y'all? Um, I'm just like, I'm on the East Coast right now because I heard it's cold out there, but it ain't. I'm in Arizona and it's like 60 degrees. Wifey's about to do some editing and uh, you gonna chill. For the rest of the night, I'm sure the kids is going to go jump on a trampoline. So, we'll watch them do that. As uh, we chill and get our um, drink on. And that's a flag. It's my turn, right? Yeah. Okay. No, yeah, no, Aiden go. Because, wait. Who just, just you uh, went? My journey. Yeah. Journey. journey. I didn't go. I went. Uh -uh, went that's like, not rolling. You that's gotta do rolling. like this and drop it. You spinning it. Are you spinning it too? You, you got the timer. Yeah. I know you got it. Something. Singing. A, sing a song. song. So you gotta sing a song. Why? Uh, sing a song. Doing.
the tree ain't on. You just t- the time is ten o'clock on the dock. Oh, we never be in here at ten o'clock. Baby, we will never be in here at all. <laughs> Did you like your Christmas? Mm-hmm. Yes. I love my happy dapper. You love your happy dapper? <laughs> okay. Yeah. You gonna sleep in it tonight? When you asked for it, you was one foot tall. Oh, day. <laughs> Definitely would have fit in it just fast. <laughs> all day. Yeah. You gonna sleep in it all day tomorrow too? Yeah. So, Christmas. It's just about over. You got two hours left. <laughs> it's bedtime. As you can see, y'all see what I was explaining to y'all earlier. This is this is where we are. Yet again. And this is after a nap. <laughs> so, we're here again. And it is bedtime for this one. Aiden has been in his room. Hence his shirt. Most likely to hide in his room. That's where he's been. Which is why y'all haven't seen him. Like, y'all saw him play the game. But he's gone again. Uh, he gives us a few minutes of his time and then he's gone. He's at that age and I, I get it. I get it But I am going to call it a night. I know this vlog is long. However, everybody should be off tomorrow or off today Y'all should have enough time to catch up with us. So we appreciate if y'all watch it all the way through Comment down below. Let me know what y'all did how y'all Christmas was. Um, we really, really appreciate it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to comment down below. Like, share, make sure you guys tell a friend about us. If you have not, hit that subscribe button for more videos here in Broadview. And remember, if you love life, vlog it. We'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Give it a thumbs up. Make sure to do the thumbs up. <laughs> All right, y'all. Talk to y'all later. Peace. Beat the frog, folks.